it was weird to me to see uh, white supremacists walking around with tiki torches because those are the very torches that black people used to keep bugs out our backyard. I didn't, I, used I didn't those know too. they worked on us too. But I, I think that now we have a situation where there is, uh, we don't have even truth uh, is suffering. There, there can't be a moral equivalence. Either it's wrong to be hateful and um, uh, to, uh, to promote violence and apathy and, and, and to be angry and to believe in the supremacy of one race over another, or it's not. And I think uh, now we have people quibbling about it. Well, they're just as bad as, as those guys, and these are just as bad. So if, if, if somebody oppresses me and I fight back, then I'm just as bad as the guy who was determined to take all my rights away. That's where we are in America right now. You see that in Charlottesville how? By when the president said not two even. things, when he said uh, not all of them were bad people, and when he said you have problems on the left and problems on the right, call them both out? Not, 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 not only just in Charlottesville, but just the entire tone of the country. We, we have, I just watched Kobach, who was on the, the, who's running for governor, and, and he, he talked about how um, you know, he did the commission on, on voter fraud. Isn't it funny how he said there were, there were thousands of people, or maybe a thousand people, who fraudulently voted? We'll, we'll investigate a problem like voter fraud, but not how many people get killed by handguns in this country. We know that there was 30,000 people. So a thousand people who, who fraudulently vote is a problem, but 30,000 people who are killed in America by, uh, by, hand, by guns is not. So we, even, even now, we, 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 we contort to make what we want truthful, um, uh, we can tour it around all that. Either there's a truth or there isn't. The bottom line in this country, it is wrong to be hateful and to lead people in hate and to try to su 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 subvert other people's rights and voices and to be brutal to them, or it isn't. Do you believe the president doesn't believe that? I believe the president is a wanton racist, and I believe that America is, un is not uncomfortable with it. When you tell me 89% of Republicans support him no matter what he does. So I'll say this. I can't say that all his supporters are racist, but I can't say this. For them, being a racist is not a disqualifier. Well, but, but I, think that's a, I think that's a high bar. Look, I, I, I said to you it's today, on your, I said to you on right. your podcast today, do I see that white extremists and white power people and the QAnon and the conspiracy crazies that they have cottoned to Trump? Yes. Is that a problem? Yes. But... Not you even just those, them. What if they don't believe that he is a racist? They don't consider themselves White racist men don't get to well? decide what racism is. White people don't get to decide what racism is. They were so bad at judging it every time it happened. They were bad at judging it during slavery. They were bad at judging it during, during Jim Crow. White people don't get to play this game. You don't get to decide what the rules are here. The bottom line is this. We have watched children being put in cages. And yes. the very scriptures that they quoted to put black men in chains... Mm -hmm. They used to put immigrants in cages. Fair point. Either it's wrong or it isn't. Either we're in America where everybody's the same or we're not. You have Laura Ingram on talking about even legal immigration. Right. So, so let's not, l l listen, I don't have a dog in this race except to say this. Now, we, we, we've seen what, 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 what side people have chosen. I can say this unequivocally. If Barack Obama were doing what, what uh, Donald Trump is doing, then two things would happen. The nation would call for him to be impeached, and I would be his loudest opponent. You can't do to people what, you, what, what, what Trump and the, and the Republicans are doing to this country. You would have called out Barack Obama Absolutely. if he was saying what Donald Abs Trump is. Not, not only would I call him out, I, I, I would do it loudly and every day. Why? Because right is right and wrong is wrong. Right is right and wrong is wrong. You can't... Our country is being torn apart. There, there is... There is a spirit in this country that is so foul, I don't even know if America can... I, I don't think we can come back from this. I know. We disagree on this. And not because I'm some Pollyanna. I, I believe that... What do you see at the same time that you see a Chris Kobach saying what's not true? You see the media stepping up, checking him, saying, no, this is what's true. You're wrong. The president, we do it all the time. It creates a fight. He does all his fake news BS. But we do it. Because there is right, there is wrong. The truth is truth a side, is. too. You got the left, you got the right, and you got reason. We get to make our own truths up in this country. We get to hear what we want to hear. There, but that doesn't not mean only there democracy, is a truth. No, no, that doesn't mean there is a truth, but it also means that we get to decide what we want to hear. We're very evocative. We want to hear what we want to hear these days. And I'll say this. I, I, I can tell you this, and I've gone all around this country. I've played places everywhere. Now we get to make our own truth up. We get to decide, like, I, I watch people contort 
uh, and say, well, even if he did meet with people, there was nothing wrong with it because people do it every day. That's a lie. When you say that the, 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 the media is the enemy of the American people, that's a lie. I watched somebody on CNN last night say, I would believe Trump over Jesus. If truth dies, how can, how can democracy live? 